The big boy. Me. And open you. Recalcitrant. It's comics and shots, a completely improvised semi comedic music by Howard Stern's Mick the Nerd, aka YouTube and TikTok's Mick the Man, aka Mick the Maverick, aka a guy who just woke up tired and never woke up. Today's subject Monel. Spoilers for Mark Wade's action comics run. Recently, 2024. Feel free to click off now, but this is primarily spoiler territory about a comic from last week and it's still going on. It's about the Phantom Zone. Baby. And Superman, you know, he's checking it out. Checking it, some, he has to go there because it's getting crazy in there. And so he, he's just going in there and he sees like the ship of the Phantom King. And he's like, oh crap, I gotta fight this guy again. And then he goes up to the mummified motherfucker himself. Sees him unbandaged himself. And who is it? Monel, the adoptive, the sort of adoptive brother of Superman. Because we're, because if you, in case you forgot, the, the backstory now is a weird combination of the New Earth continuity. And Silver Age 1, where Superman was a kid and member of the Legion of Superheroes. If that sounds really confusing, because his son John also has a separate su Legion of Superheroes. As well as his clone brother Connor having his own Legion of Superheroes. It's because it is, and it, they will never resolve it properly. I'm sorry, Lodge fans. But hey, mon -El's here. We can We can enjoy that. Uh, yeah. The real model, not that sad Nepo baby from the Brian Michael Bendis comics. Who might also was also probably just the actual Monel in disguise and there was a whole conspiracy. That's not a spoiler or anything, that was just my theory about what was supposed to happen. How would be able to do? Yeah. I'm looking forward to seeing Monel in this new capacity. It seems like he's a little bit antagonistic to Clark. I mean you shove a guy into the ghost zone for that long, they're gonna turn out crazy. Yes, I know, it's the Phantom Zone. Ghost Zone is Danny Phantom. On the subject, how did they get away with that? <laughs> oh, Danny Phantom, you have a large fandom, but it is basically a weird mishmash of superhero tropes. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, um, like... I don't really know that much about the Phantom King. He's kind of more of a New 52 supervillain. You know, he's just like Kryptonian criminal, gets superpowers in the void, yada yada yada. But Monel, ugh. And what version of Monel are we dealing with? Is it like, are we assuming this is straight up like from when Clark was a teenager? Wait, actually, here's another weird thought about this. Um, Clark was a teenager, met Monel. Then he meets him in the future again with the Legion of Superheroes who cure him of his lead poisoning. Uh. Oh man, Clark is gonna be buttoning his lip for most of this, isn't he? Or will he? Because the timeline of the Legion of Superheroes in DC Comics is so convoluted and stupid. Would it even matter if he told him anything? Would it matter at all? I don't know. Ugh. So confusing and weird. And that's Legion of Superheroes in DC Comics for a T there, baby. Oh, man. Oh, Monel, Monel, Monel. Will they free you from the Phantom Hell? And will they make a new, better Legion of Superheroes series? If you bring Brian Michael Bendis back, give him a proper editor, please. It's not that he's a bad writer. It's that sometimes you gotta say no to people like that. Yeah. 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 Yeah, not, I get not many thoughts on that. 
not much else. Yeah, Monel is in the Phantom Zone, talking it up with Superman. And who? Oh, by, by the way, Superman still has his powers because he's got like a little super core like solar bracelet. So that's gonna be fun. That thing's gonna break. That thing's gonna break. Oh boy. <laughs> uh. Super Action Comics Phantoms. I think that's what it's called. 2024. Mark Wade. Let's see what happens this week, my babies. I'm getting it tomorrow. As well as Green Lantern 16, because for some reason, my, my comic shop just forgets some of them sometimes. The only human. With that, like, comment, and subscribe. Donate if you're feeling nice. Share it with a bear. And I always remember, praise me to the blood elk, fear the stab epotamus, and death to Kronos. <sighs> Offices in South Jersey, please order more catering. Stop making me have to commute all the way to Philadelphia just to get an honest buck. Have a knack, folks.